New details on a fire that tore through a home in Hobble Creek Canyon this morning. Three firefighters were hurt and the home now is a total loss. And the flames started at around 4 a.m. at this home on Hobble Creek Haven Road. Family got out safely, but it took crews 15 to 20 minutes to get to this unincorporated area. The fire ripped through the house, causing the roof to collapse. That collapse actually caused debris to fall on top of one firefighter, pinning his leg. Another suffered smoke inhalation. Officers on scene saw the collapse, knew there were firefighters inside, and actually forced their way in to save those firefighters. Ultimately, they decided to let the home burn down, which it did over the next several hours. What one legislator is calling the crown jewel of mental health bills passed in the House unanimously. It would provide crisis receiving centers for people in distress. These would be 24-7, 365 facilities no appointment necessary. So there's not all the BP machines and maybe people being wheeled by on stretchers. The bill would also fund additional mobile crisis outreach teams for rural Utah, which Elison says are like ambulances without flashing lights and sirens. Additionally, the bill would fund a statewide warm line. There's no obvious signs of trauma to this individual. Salt Lake City Police are investigating a suspicious death after discovering a man's body inside of a pipe. Detectives tell us the pipe is about 18 inches wide and the opening is just above the ground. Leads to more piping below. Police say that the body was stuck in a section of the pipe that is underground. But how it got there, that's what investigators are still trying to sort out. Fire crews got the call to help get the man's body out without digging up the pipe. Police are also investigating items found in that area that may belong to him.